What's the creepiest thing you caught someone doing? I went to a homeschool co-op growing up, this kid a few grades behind me, I was in 11th, he was in 8th I think, always would disappear to the bathroom to pretend to shit but was actually playing Game Boy. His teacher sent me to see what he was doing, I go in the bathroom, and immediately he yells go away. I'm going to the bathroom, I look under the stall from across the room, the boy's pants, underwear, socks and shoes are neatly in a pile in the corner, the boy was facing the toilet, laying on his back with his legs wrapped around the base of the toilet with a full-on lil boy action. We made eye contact. I went back to class, his teacher demanded to know what he was doing. I whispered it in her ear after she asked a third time. I got in trouble for some reason? I'm sorry, I'm the one who has the image of a toilet fucker in my head the rest of my life. I was in my bed then my 5 year old sister came in and said my name, I didn't say anything back, she's went into the bed and started licking my back. Once I was taking a shit in a public restroom and heard weird noises, so I looked under the stall to check the feet of the dude next to me. I'm not sure why, I just did it to be safe. Turns out the dude next to me was checking at the exact same time I was. It was so fucking awkward as we made eye contact nearly upside down by our underwear. I guess it was weird for both of us. My neighbor stands in the backyard and stares through my windows. She also stands outside my apartment door and occasionally follows me into town and into stores. She's a well-known creep in town but nothing can be done really because that's as far as she ever takes it also. My state doesn't have great stalking laws so the police can't touch her either. Here's one a bit different from the sexual and bathroom related responses. I was living at a halfway house and we had chicken for dinner one day. Later that night I went in the kitchen to get a midnight snack. There was a guy in there arranging the chicken bones from earlier into weird patterns on a table. I asked him what he was up to and he looked at me very seriously and said he was summoning a demon. I had never seen a demon before, so, obviously I had some questions and hung around to see the show. Long story short. No demon showed up. It was both creepy and disappointing. This actually just happened. I took my daughters, 13 and 15, to Disney World a few weeks ago. We were waiting in the security line at the Orlando airport, waiting to come back. If you have never been, the security line at the Orlando airport is super long and snakes back and forth forever, so you keep passing the same people again and again. I saw a guy, maybe in his 30s or 40s take out his phone and appear to be texting but when we went around the next corner, I could see that he was aiming the camera at my daughter, trying to take a picture of her. It only caught my eye because he did the zoom in thing on her legs. I said oh excuse me, can I help you? It looks like you were having trouble with your camera? Right in his face, he got out of line. I probably should have told security but my knee jerk reaction was to get in between them and address him. I once went to a family meetup and someone invited a person we knew was a pedo. Other than that pissing off a bunch of people I also was basically given guard duty to follow him around for the 4 to 5 hours we were there. He took one of the kids off on his bike alone. But I can't really do anything about that cause his mom was fine with it. But when he was following my sister I noticed him intentionally dropping things in front of her to make her bend over to pick them up. Nearly killed a person that day. There's a guy in my town that just goes to the beaches and takes the seat off his bike and fucks the seat post hole in front of everyone. Edit. Okay I wasn't clear. With the seat off the bike, he lays on his back and flips the bike upside down into the air and then puts his dick into the hole in the frame where the seat post used to go, then using his arms on the handles and feet on the pedals he moves the bike up and down. Some guy turned on a computer in our school, set it to play loud porn and then just kinda left the schoolhouse. A guy at work used to add a can of black beans into his bowl of chicken noodle soup. I used to think that was weird until I caught him pretending to be a 15 year old boy on the internet so he could chat with underage girls. It was like a fake live stream so it really looked like he was a kid, too. Not long after he was fired and arrested. Thanks for listening. Subscribe for more daily videos.